All right, take two. I just, like, recorded this intro, and then I realized I wasn't recording. This is the second time I've tried to record today and haven't been recording. I'm super good at YouTube. Don't worry about it. Okay, today, I'm going to be seeing how much money I can make back from 64 shiny orbs. Yeah, uh, if you didn't know, shiny orbs can be bought from Techno the Mayor Pigman for 2,000 coins apiece. And it, it it's uh, 128,000 for a stack, which is what I have. So... I, I need it. Okay. Time to take out my emerald ring or else Undertaker will eat me or something. I don't know. Um, please don't, please don't, like, cancel me, Undertaker. Thank you. Um, yeah, so I'm going to see how much money I make. Uh, if you don't know, yeah, this is how it works. You hit the pig with a big ball. Then you beat the pig back to the ball. And then it dies, and then you get things. Three grand. And I'm, like, if I get items, I'm just gonna sell it. Or I'll just, like, give a total at the end of all the things I got before selling. So, yeah, I guess I'll do a time lapse or just cut straight to the point where I'm done. Let's see how I do. Oh, I just realized that, um,. You can get skill XP, so I actually have to, like, take note of it, or, again, Undertaker will cancel me. Let's take a bunch of screenshots. I don't think you can get, like, any of these, so I'm just not gonna bother. Okay. 1k farm XP. Yeah. I continue. How? Why? Okay, I'm just gonna combo it so hard, it's just gonna go up there. Magically, right? That's how this world works. Uh, can I, like, fishing rod it? I can, okay. Get up here. Get up here. This isn't gonna work. Oh, this is so sad. I guess I have to go buy another one. But I have to take 2k out of here. Yeah. I don't know. If this is, like, against the rules, please don't... Please don't bully me. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Oh, quick check-in, but I am now halfway done. Or, I guess a little more than halfway, but... 31 more to go. Let's get it. Alright, just got two more here. This one, and then one more. And I will be done. Then I will, like, throw the seven different recordings I have into editor, edit, and then magically get numbers. Um, here's the last one. There we go. All right. Spoiler. That, that's actually probably pretty bad. I got like four potato spreadings earlier from like half of this. Yeah. Yikes. Oh okay. god. Well, see you in a sec. All right. Here I am. I'm gonna record selling all my stuff real quick, and then I'll go do skill XP, and then like do the math for. Things I can't sell to Bazaar. So 290,000 coins from potatoes, pork, and grins. Um, already looking pretty good. Let's see, farming for dummies, it's probably like 2k. And if you can't tell, farming for dummies is basically a hot potato book for a farming tool. Axe or hoe, whatever you are using as it gives one farming fortune per book. 5k. <laughs> Let me guess, potato spreading is like 1k. Nope, 5k. Do they... Yeah, okay, so this is another 15k. That's pretty cool. Glad I didn't sell them earlier when they were 50k apiece. 
I'll try to use them. But yeah, so that brings the total up to this number. Um, let's see what I got for skill XP. Okay, I'm back with the numbers for skill experience. Got 1,000 farming XP. Let's see. Started with 448,000, or about that. I got a little bit more, because, like, when you drop potatoes, it gives you, like, two farming XP. So it's very it's close to that, but not quite. I got 8,000 mining XP, started with about 66,000. 1,000 combat XP, started with 612,000. Zero foraging XP, that's pretty good, I'd gotta say. Um, one thousand, no, two thousand fishing XP. That's pretty crazy. One hundred fifty-nine thousand at the start. Two thousand enchanting XP. Uh, that number minus two. It's too big for me to read. I don't. I, I can't count that high. And then two thousand alchemy XP, which I started with fifty-six thousand. So in total, that is sixteen thousand skill XP. Isn't that pretty crazy? I mean, it's not bad, because you have, so let's see, 16,000 skill XP, plus 482-ish thousand coins, and 482,000 is just under four times what I paid. So, I mean, that's pretty good. Um, I'd say, if you, this is a good money-making method for early game maybe like early mid game is um yeah it gives it multiplies your money a lot but it's really long time and if you're like really tight on money i guess you can do it too uh yeah money got quintupled no quadrupled um it also took me like 20 minutes to do it 20 25 um I can put an exact number up on the screen right now. So, you could, let's see, in theory I made 340,000 coins in, say, 25 minutes, call it half an hour. So that's 460,000 460, coins. Math, wait, no, I made 340,000. Look, math is hard. That's 680,000 coins. Gosh, in an hour. Which... For early game, is definitely really good. Um, if you're mid or mid late mid or some game, just like go farm zealots or something. I don't know. You can make way more than that. But it's it's also more fun activity than farming zealots. So you know it's got that going for it. Um, and it's interesting because you can get these special drops, and then there's whatever the like. Uh, relics are. See, so yeah, I think this is it's a really fun mini game. Uh, pretty engaging. Can't wait to just, like max out my my farming things once I can actually like get into them. They're all in here right now. I just have like these. <laughs> Everything stuck in my backpacks. Please fix backpacks. All right. Anyways, I think that's gonna do it. Uh, if you have any more questions about this uh, experiment, test, whatever you want to call it, uh, just leave them down below. I probably forgot like 15 things. Please don't bully me. Thank you so much. Bye.